1732, General James Oglethorpe sailed from England to the southeastern coast of North America with 40 families to establish a home for England's worthy poor. This venture would lead to British colonial expansion in the southeast with the establishment of the colony of Georgia in 1733. As he sailed through the inner waterways of present-day Georgia and South Carolina, Oglethorpe found the ideal place to settle his colony, far from the hostile Spanish stronghold in Florida. Yamacraw Bluff, named after the Indian tribe that lived there, was a lush and popular trading site where a charismatic couple, John and Mary Musgrove, had recently set up a trading post. Oglethorpe met Tomachichi, Miko of the Yamacraw Indians, and formally asked for permission to settle his people on their land with Mary Musgrove as interpreter. Only after Tomachichi gave his consent did Oglethorpe instruct his people to prepare for the construction of the city of Savannah. Tomachichi presented buffalo and deer skins to Oglethorpe, who reciprocated with presents from England. Oglethorpe and Tomachichi would sign the Treaty of Friendship and signed the charter of the colony of Georgia. Tomachichi accompanied Oglethorpe to England with his wife, nephew, and a small delegation of Creeks. He met with King George and Queen Caroline at Kensington Palace, as well as some important English dignitaries. He presented the king with eagle feathers as a token of peace. He also pushed for the demands of his people, education and fair trade. This led to the establishment of English speaking schools for Native Americans in Georgia. In 1739, Tomachichi died in his late 90s. He was buried in Savannah as he had requested, and Oglethorpe held a traditional military funeral in his honor and served as one of his pallbearers. He arranged for a pyramid of stones to be placed over his grave in Wright Square in observance of Indian tradition. <music>